Hello YouTube, and uh, welcome to another one of my cooking videos. You may be wondering <laughs> why there's uh, two slices of bread. And that's because I'm going to be making a Uncrustable. Uh, this will taste exactly like one of those uh, Smucker's Uncrustables. And uh, let's just get started. So first of all, we got our ingredients. We have some, uh, some Jiffy peanut butter. It's uh, creamy. You can always use smooth uh, if you'd like, but um, I like creamy. I don't really like a crunch in my sandwich. And then we also have uh, Marion Blackberry. Um, hopefully you guys can see this. Marion Blackberry. This is uh, from Costco. Okay, now nothing too complex. So this is what we're gonna do. We each have a uh, a uh, butter knife, and we're just gonna put our peanut butter on the bread. Now, um, the reason I'm making this video is because, um, like those regular Smucker sandwiches, they're like four dollars for a two or something like that. I don't know. They're just, like super high priced and. Uh, uh, you can also, with this method or technique, you can uh, customize your sandwich to uh, any way you'd like. My dog's in the background, Rocky. He's a pretty cool dog. But anyway, so, yeah, you could always add, like, um, honey to this or, uh, you know, just anything, really. Uh, okay, so we have our... Uh, our cloth and we're just going to wipe it with the paper towel so then we can use this for jelly. Now we're just going to put this lid back on and then we're going to spread the dang jelly. Okay. Not too much, actually, however much you want because it's really the person's preference. But, um, let me just wipe this jelly here and uh, I'm just going to spread this jelly right quick. Now I'm obviously not being the most neat, uh, you know, because this is just, uh, just to show you guys like how easy it really is to make. Okay, so just to make a regular sandwich. You know, this happens to be with white bread, but you can use uh, any type of bread, really. Um, let me just clean up this mess right here real quick. There we go. Okay, so we have our sandwich. Nothing too, like, special. But um, now here's where you get off the crust. And you just want to flatten your bread just a little bit. Um, I'm doing this so uh, I can get the whole entire crust off and basically get as much of this stuff as possible. Now, basically is what we're going to do. We're going to take this cup, put it over the sandwich. As you can see, um, there's no crust. As you can, I don't know, you can't really see it that well. But there's uh, basically no crust here and we're just gonna make sure just double check and push down okay and then um, so my brother's actually coming back from a weight room practice so I'm gonna turn this off and take two as you cat <laughs> okay guys um, I, had to, I had to turn off the camera because my brother just got back from weight room but anyway, so what I basically did is I just uh, pushed down the lid, or uh, the cup, into the bread, basically. This is basically self-explanatory. I just wanted to show you guys how it's done. And so make sure it's pushed down, and then you can just take, like, one edge, and then basically it all comes off, like so. So here's the whole crust. As you can see, we got, like most of the, the white stuff and uh, in here is the sandwich.
now just do a little thing with you like that. And then there's your uncrustable sandwich. Um, you know, uh, this isn't perfect, but I mean, you can see it's comparable to Smucker's Uncrustable. And you can just, like, say if you had, like, eight sandwiches all made, you could, uh, take them, you know, take the cup, do that eight separate times, and, uh, freeze them for, like, a school snack or something like that. That's what I'm gonna do. And, uh, there you go. You got a pre made sandwich that has no crust on it. And you could always eat the crust separately. But, um, thanks for watching, guys. So if you like this, uh, please give me a rate, comment, and or subscribe. And I will see you in my next video. Thanks, guys. Bye.